Subscribe to the NBA Focus channel for breaking news, we share up-to-date content. The Milwaukee Bucks, one of the most talked about teams heading into this NBA season, find themselves in an unexpected and worrisome position, holding a 1-5 record for the first time since the 2000-2001 season. As the crowd slowly filtered out of Fiserv Forum after a heartbreaking 114-113 loss to the Cleveland Cavaliers on Saturday night, the frustration was palpable. The game seemed won when Damian Lillard, who delivered a spectacular 41-point performance, hit a clutch step-back jumper to give the Bucks a one-point lead with only 10 seconds left. Yet, Donovan Mitchell stole the spotlight, draining an incredible shot with just 0.3 seconds on the clock, sealing Milwaukee's fate and plunging the Bucks further into their early season struggles. Despite this, there's no full-blown panic inside the Bucks camp. Giannis Antetokounmpo, who put in a heroic effort with 34 points, 16 rebounds, and 9 assists, remained focused on what he could control. I don't focus on the results, Giannis explained post-game. My job is to focus on the things I can do better as a basketball player, the things I can control. I can't control the outcome of games. His emphasis on maintaining the right mentality echoes throughout the roster, where a sense of calm persists for now, despite the mounting pressure. Even head coach Doc Rivers maintained that the team's attitude isn't the issue, praising how the players have approached games. Veteran forward Torian Prince reinforced this belief, expressing confidence in the team's future. The expectations are still there. We're still optimistic, we just have to figure some things out," he said. Yet, there's no denying that words alone won't dig the bucks out of this hole. The franchise, after all, has championship aspirations and an ownership group that's invested heavily to make it happen. Since the 2021-22 season, they've spent over $700 million on payroll and luxury taxes, but they have only one playoff series win to show for it. Co-owner Wes Edens didn't mince words, labeling this result as incredibly frustrating, on the court, the Bucks have shown some encouraging signs. Even without Chris Middleton, who is recovering from off-season ankle surgeries, their starting lineup has a solid net rating of plus 5.5. Middleton's return should address multiple issues. Offensively, the team ranks in the top 12 across several key metrics, and their recent schedule has been particularly grueling. With upcoming matchups against teams lower in the standings, there's hope for a turnaround. Nevertheless, the concerns are real. Milwaukee's defense, currently ranking 24th in the league, has been a major letdown. Prince highlighted the need for more cohesion on that end, while Rivers admitted, we haven't been able to sustain 48 minutes. We have these lulls where we don't score, we don't get stops. The Bucks' current predicament goes beyond unlucky bounces or tough matchups. If they truly want to compete for a title, they'll need to address these critical issues. The organization finds itself at a crossroads. If meaningful improvements aren't made soon, the team could face significant changes. While that fan's call for a full rebuild might be premature, there's no denying that the Bucks' window for walking the walk is rapidly shrinking. Join the legends and be a part of your team's exclusive community by hitting the join button. Whether you're a proud member of Lakers Nation, standing strong with Warriors Tribe, or representing the Celtics legends, there's a place for every fan. Support your favorite team, unlock special perks, and connect with fellow fans who share your passion. Don't miss your chance to be more than just a fan, become a part of history.